Hey everybody, today we're going to talk to you about replacing a transducer on our older VX1 and our VX1P series flashers. There's a couple things that you're going to need to do to, before you can get to that back of that head unit where that transducer screws in to the unit itself. You're going to take your soft pack off. It really helps to remove the battery as you see here um, from what I'm doing. The older series does have a metal collar as you see in the video right now on the back of this head unit. All you're going to do do is unscrew that collar and that plug is going to come out of the back of that head unit. You know, whether you damage your, your deucer, you cut it, it's not working anymore, you're going to need a new transducer. So I have that new transducer here. All I'm going to do is take that plug, there's three prongs in it, or three holes, and then those line up with the prongs that are actually in the back of that head unit. So I'm going to slide that transducer into the back of that head unit and then lock that collar down as you can see and then you're all set to go after you put that system all back together. If you do have any more questions, visit MarkhamTech.com.